Hey guys, welcome back to the gaming channel and today I'm back with the game that we haven't played in a while which is Bus Simulator 18. Um, so if you haven't checked out my last Bus Sim video, do make sure to check it out. I'll put the link in the description and in the cards above. Um, but basically we're going to be continuing on from where we left off last time. Um, so now we're basically going to be expanding our business a bit uh, because before we only had like two routes um, and one bus uh, but today we're going to be trying to complete um, this set of objectives here so we're first going to start by buying a new bus so what we're going to do is go to the bus garage and uh, we're going to go to the shop so we have actually since last time we've unlocked a new bus which is this one it's the um, s416 le business etc and as you can see it's a pretty nice bus it's a bit bigger than our last one um, and yeah so we're gonna buy this bus because we already have a sitar okay so let's go ahead and buy it and um, then we can have a drive with it uh, so next objective is to hire a new driver so let's go to the employees and uh, we have our applications here so as you can see we have no employees so right now i'm the only driver so we're gonna hire some more uh so first is mary boos owns a hamster named fridolin uh plays the drums in a rock band joys cinema classes okay she sounds like a good candidate marcus condorus never ate a banana loves to watch cartoons loves murder mysteries and romantic novels okay maybe not uh, and Sophie Stoker hums while driving, um, can't calculate change in his head, favors Forvers, I think that was a typo, Forvers French cuisine. Um, let's go, go with Mary Boost because I think she sounds the best. Um, I don't think someone who can't count change in their head is going to be very good. And I also don't think that someone who loves murder mysteries is very good. And so, yeah, let's just go with Mary Boos. Um, and there we go. Now we have a driver. So if we go back to our route planner. Now, our next objective is to generate income on a route with a driver. So these we've already driven these two routes. So let's create a new route now. And basically, my objective is let's um, make a route that goes throughout the whole of this area, Astra Park. So it'll go from here. Let's go from there to there to there. And we're basically going to kind of just go through all the stops over here because uh, we've already driven the last two routes. There we go. And it says it only should, only should take about 11 minutes. And we're also going to drive this route and then assign a driver to it. So we have two buses on this route. So what we're going to do is click on Mary Boost and we're going to assign him or her, I don't know, um, to drive the sitar K okay, so that we can drive the new bus, the S416. So then now we're going to drive it. And uh, let's go for daytime because it's a new bus and I don't know what the driving conditions will be like. So uh, let's just have all this on. Um, yeah, let's just get started. So uh, here we go. And uh, it's quite a big steering wheel actually. Um, so let's put the retarder to one. Um, if you don't know, the retarder is basically the braking. So just putting the braking to one so that um, it's not too, the braking is a bit more difficult, easy. Um, but yeah, let's just get started. So I'm going to accelerate now and our first stop is right over Next here. Stop, Media, Center, Astra. Media Center, Astra. Okay, there you go. Good stopping position. I wonder if the passengers will notice if it's a new bus. One okay, one ticket, single senior one. And 820. Welcome. Uh, week regular two. That's what we like to see. Um, week tickets um, cost the most and two of them especially okay another week one that's perfect okay so we're getting a lot of money already okay and there we go so let's close the bus and we haven't started our timer yet so let's do a quick ticket check uh, make sure we've got everyone everyone has tickets oh we've already got our first fare dodger that's not good trying to sneak into the bus What? Uh, there we go okay so yeah we will not tolerate any um, free rides here at A-Express. Okay, so let's continue. So because of that person, we got an extra 120 euros. Okay, Stalker Square is next. Well, don't get sick on this new bus. It's a brand new bus. I don't want to be cleaning vomit on my first day. Um, but yeah, so this is actually the same area as we were in last time. Uh, Astra Park. It's just a small business park, uh, but after we complete this set of objectives, speed bump, let's slow down. Yeah, after we complete this set of objectives, we'll be unlocking a new area, um, the northern area, so we'll finally be able to serve some new bus stops. Uh, yeah, so this is the same area, but we're just doing a full route around now. 
um, because why not? It's out probably um, only this time. This is probably the last episode where we'll basically drive only in this area. So why not do a full loop around? I have noticed that the steering wheel does turn quite a lot. It turns, it bends a lot, basically, whenever I turn. Okay, here we go. Oh. Yeah, the ba braking on this bus isn't the best, because you can see we went way past the stopping point. So I might actually just increase the retarder to 2. Just so that we have a bit more breakage. Yeah, so apparently when they say these things, they're talking about a show called Winter of Passion. Uh, I'm just doing a quick ticket check because I did see ticket. quite a lot of people coming I in. You my ticket. Here's the ticket. And as you can see, there is that kind of an upper platform on this bus. I you my yeah, I know you did, but you have to show it every time I ask. Okay, uh, so now... Oh, and I opened the doors. They're already closed. Now we can continue, and I have to reverse a bit, otherwise I'm going to collide with the pavement so let's reverse oh, own battery oh dear okay um and now let's switch to drive there you go so we are running a little bit behind schedule but not too bad Next stop, Square. so we're gonna turn right here let's try and do it without crashing oh no i've already collided I don't know with what I collided with, but still. Yeah, I am not good at turning buses. I always hit something. Especially this bus, since it's a little bit bigger than the last one. Okay, let's turn left. Okay, here we go. Greenwich Square. So let's... Okay, perfect stopping you. position. Although I did go a little bit on the curbstone still. I, need a few I wouldn't say it's perfect, but if the game says it is, then I guess it is. Single student 2, not too bad. 640. Thanks. I need to purchase Single, seven. regular 3. That's a lot of tickets. I don't know why someone would need that many tickets, because, I mean, he's only by himself. So we are running a little bit late, so I'm not going to have time to do a ticket check. And also, I don't think it's necessary to do one after every stop. So again, I'm just going to reverse a little bit. And switch back to drive. And let's get out of here. Let's go to the next stop. Next stop, Okay, so we still have a bit of time to get there. Yeah, so, so far this bus is not too bad, but I don't know if I would say I prefer it more than... Oh, I hit that speed bump a little bit too fast. In last week's episode, they finally revealed that Hans has a twin sister. Christina. Wow, so shocking. So yeah, you'll cl sometimes you'll hear them saying little stuff like that, having conversations in the back. Although I do think it is a little bit strange how at just randomly someone will say something quite loudly and then it'll go completely silent. Uh, let's stop. Yeah, I definitely say that the braking is not very good on this bus. Because every time I've stopped, I've pretty much stopped too far ahead. Okay, let's go. And every time I've gone to this bus stop, there's some um, cars blocking the way. So let's just indicate left so people know that we want to leave. Yeah, generally say um, the driving on this bus, it's not too bad, but I think I'd still prefer the Sitaro. Just because I think this big steering wheel is not really good, and the braking isn't good as well. But oh well, we'll drive the other bus next time. Okay, so we're pulling over now. I do really like the um, the scenery. That's one of the great things about this game. 
is basically how it's modeled, how it looks. Perfect timing. I didn't do as badly with the parking position this time. Okay, I don't think anyone's getting on. So let's go on. Is there anyone even in the bus? Okay, yeah, there are a lot of people. So next stop is North Spoke. I might do a ticket check at the next, next stop. So this one's quite close actually. And let's see if I if I can do well with the parking. We got one. Not really. Yeah, I did it too much ahead. I don't think it looks like anyone's getting off at this stop or on. Um, but I am a little bit early, so I can do a quick ticket check. Just make sure no one else what? is trying to get sure. a free ride. I already showed it. Here. I think oh, this lady's been on the bus the it? whole time. The problem is, is that since everyone pretty much looks the same, it's hard for me to tell like who I've already checked and who I haven't. Oh, I hit the curbstone. So yeah, um, if you don't know already, basically, oh, someone crossing the street. Let's just wait for them. Um, if you don't know already, Bus Sim Twenty One came out, uh, of course, like about two years ago. Um, oh no, did I miss my turn? Oh, I thought I was going to that stop. Okay. Um, Okay, I'm going to try and reverse because there's no cars behind me instead of doing a full loop around again. So let's switch to reverse. Oh no, there was a car behind me. Oh well. Okay, um, I guess I'll just have to go around again because um, now that car is blocking me. Oh well, my fault. So as I was saying, if um, Bustim 21 is out now. And um, basically what my plan is, is that I want to do a bit more of this game. And then eventually I will check out Bus Sim 21 and see how it is. Because um, if it's a newer game... Oh dear. Yeah, I'm not doing too well this run. I've already had a few collisions. Uh, so I want to basically finish this game or at least do a bit more of it. And um, then I'm going to do some Bus Sim 21 videos and then we can compare it and see which one is better. Okay, so we're going to turn right over here. Yeah, now we are quite a bit late. We're already a minute late because I missed that turn, but it was my fault. Uh... Yeah, I'm okay if I actually if I turn into the second lane and there's no cars then I'm okay with the turns It's only when there are cars there and then I have to turn in this narrow lane that I always hit something Okay, let's oh no there's traffic. I don't know why the cars aren't moving Go we have a schedule to keep we're already two minutes late probably gonna get told off for being late um, but they're not doing anything there's no cars literally no cars and now they're doing they're not going there we go finally okay so there is some construction here I don't know if they're building a new bus stop or I don't know what's happening okay here we go Next stop. yeah some people waiting I'll never get to my appointment. We're only on time. two minutes late, but I don't think you won't get to your appointment on time, but Yeah, we were late, but because we had to do that whole loop around. Oh, this new bus is really Oh thank nice. you. Finally someone noticed uh, the new bus. I was getting a little bit upset that no one seemed to notice it, but someone just made our day. Um and next is South Spo. Uh so this one is I think where I was where I originally went to. And the problem is with this Oh no, again I hit this road. Okay, so I'm just gonna reset. Oh, I'm just gonna reset my bus to the street, then we can turn again. 
the problem with this game I was saying is that um, if you're late to one stop you're pretty much going to be late to the other stops because they, you'll encounter traffic and stuff and then pretty much they don't give you actually much time to get between stops so like unless your next stop is in another area and they give you a lot of time it's quite likely you're going to be late come on we have a schedule to follow yeah, again, I think this is a little bit of a problem with the AI, is that they don't... The cars often don't move. Okay, so I'm gonna... This is quite a tight turn. There you go, I made it. Yeah, so that is one problem I think maybe the developers need to saw is that the, often the AI is just sitting there for ages. And, like, even if there's no traffic... Yeah, so I think we'll be a little late for this stop, but not too late. Just maybe a couple of seconds. I was way too late at the old sawmill. Yeah, so you'll often hear them talking about a few things. Either their cats, um, old sawmill, or something else. I think winter of passion, that's it. Oh no, why is there a car blocking the way? Beep, beep, move. Yeah, so the old song is basically this kind of, it's like some, I don't know, bar or nightclub or concert or something um, that you often hear people saying that they go at night to. And it is actually, I heard that it is actually one of the bus stop so eventually we'll unlock it and then we can see what the old sawmill is all about because I keep hearing people speaking about it so I'm kind of intrigued now what it's like and also one thing we can do is um, actually do um, we can actually get out of our bus and um, visit different places and there are some collectibles you can collect if you visit some of the oh, if you can if you visit some of the landmarks and there is also a mode called free realm where you can basically you don't have to do a bus route you can just like go anywhere you want in the city and explore so let me know if you'd like to see that i think i'll do that though um once i unlock some more areas of, of the city because of course now we've pretty much seen this whole area so yep that's the end of the trip i would say not too bad let's end our trip and see how we did yeah unfortunately five collisions but i'm not blaming myself too much because um, it was mostly because of the bad braking on this bus. Um, so it's safe to say I don't think I'll be driving with this bus again. Um, okay, so the next objective is to transport at least 180 passengers. But I'm going to leave it there for this video because um, basically for that video I'm going to have to... To complete that objective I'm going to have to basically drive all these routes like back and forth five different times at least. Um... Yeah, so we've only transported 73, so that's less than half. So I'm actually going to do that in my own time. And then next time we play Bus Sim, um, we will be unlocking the new areas and we'll be finally doing some um, new routes away from this business park. Uh, so yeah, that's basically it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And also do make sure to turn on notifications so you don't miss any new videos. From now on, I will be uploading once a week every Sunday. So do make sure to check the videos, the channel every Sunday as there will most likely be a video there, but still do enable notifications. And also join my Discord server if you haven't already. I'm putting the link in the description. Um, I do streams there every Saturday and and I also will upload, put any important announcements there and s tell you guys when I upload a new video. Um, so, yep, that's basically it. Let me know what you think about Bus Sim. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.